Aries, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to your love bite. Aries, let's see what's the message here for you today. And a warm welcome back to all my subscribers and welcome in newcomers. Aries spirit, what does Aries need to know? Aries. All right, Aries, King of Cups, somebody is in love. Okay. Queen of Pentacles, Nine of Swords, Two of Pentacles, Justice, Ten of Cups, <laughs> Judgment in Reverse and the Three of Wands in Reverse. Uh, somebody wants to speak their truth but they don't know whether they will get a second chance or not. It's almost like um, they're waiting or maybe looking into the future, seeing the other person as their perfect partner. But look at the amount of stress, anxiety, wondering how to make things right, how to offer this Ten of Cups, not knowing whether they will get a second chance. Somewhere they are dreading that they won't. All right, so let's see what's going to happen. I'm going to clarify these cards for you, of course, Aries. But first, let's start with some dialogue message cards. Let's see if you guys could say something to each other, what that would be. And then we'll have to clarify these cards. This could also be somebody needs to end some previous commitment before they can get this. Aries and their person spirit. Aries and their person, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Okay, let's take a few more Aries from another deck. Aries and their future, future, I'm saying Aries and their person. Aries, yeah, it could be a future person, I don't know. Aries and their person spirit, if they could say something to each other now. All right, and a few more Aries from a third deck as well, and then we'll start the reading. Aries and their person spirit. Aries and their person. Aries and their person. All right, good to go Aries. Let's start the reading. And if any of you are looking for personal readings, my email is omkarataro at gmail.com. You can reach me there. It's there in the description box below as well. The first card says, I always knew since the first day that you were the one for me. I always knew from the first day that you were always the one for me. I know you feel the same way. If you didn't, why would you keep in touch and get triggered when I say, next lifetime? Enough of divine timing already. You want to be with me and I want to be with you. Why can't we get our shit together now? I really love you. No matter where I am, your thoughts never leave my mind. The moon makes me think of you and the shine of the moon is like your guiding light. I claim you as mine. Trust me, my love. I will find you when the time is right. I want to hold you tight in my arms and never let you go. All those secrets I kept caught up with me. Each and every last one of them. Give me more time. I'm working on becoming a better counterpart for you. I carry guilt for the way I mistreated you. You made me see a side of me that I've grown to hate. I was dishonest with you and myself. I lived one big lie. You accepted me for me, the good the bad and the ugly. I couldn't do the same. I never truly moved on, even though I appear so. I can't believe how much time we've wasted on bullshit. All right. So Aries, these were some of your messages. If these were resonating with your storyline, let's start the reading. But first, an angel blessing card is always. Uh, my angels, what do you have for my Aries? Blessing guidance, advice, or a message. Commitment. Somebody is ready for commitment, but they're not sure whether they're going to get it. I'm telling you, Aries. Let's see. This, of course, could be you, could be your cross watcher. I don't know. So, Spirit, tell me, the first card here itself is the King of Cups. King of Cups, would you like the mic? 
Ooh, King of Cups has a lot of love in their heart. This could be somebody who's coming to pour their whole heart and soul. I mean, this King of Cups is is holding that cup, right? This person is envisioning a happily ever after. They want the Ten of Cups. They want the Four of Wands. They want an equal give and take. But uh, I guess they have to be able to talk about it. So now they're trying to gather up their courage and. To do that, it's taking them not only just courage, but a lot of sleepless nights, stress, tension. How do I say it? What do I do? How do I, you know, convince the other person maybe? So tell me, tell me what's the three of wands? What's the three of wands? What's the waiting for? What are you doing here, king of cups? Yeah, they're looking into their future and um, they're trying to figure things out. They're trying to figure things out, maybe listening to their intuition, how to work on this. They probably know they have to end something to start something new. The death card is here. Uh, yeah, it's kind of uh, making them feel a bit scattered right now or feeling a little imbalanced. They could be a little worried as well. Yeah, the minute I said worried, here's the no, eight, nine of swords again. It's like, yeah, they're a little worried that... Um, uh, the other person may not see them in the same light maybe and has detached themselves or is walking away from them. But whatever said and done, they value the other person a lot. They see the other person as a queen of pentacles, somebody who is loving, kind, generous, you know, financially stable and a perfect life, life partner. Uh, they want to match that energy. They want to be the king of pentacles to the queen of pentacles. It's like, yeah, I see, I see us as together forever. But again, the nine of swords, the stress and the anxiety and the worry and all that is going on as well. Tell me about the nine of swords, spirit. What's the nine of swords? Nine of swords. This person sees the other person as a star, maybe, or somebody very beautiful. Uh, they are a little worried uh, and getting a little impatient because they feel that uh, while they try and figure things out, what if their person moves on to somebody else? Am I right, person A? Uh, sorry, person A, I'm saying King of Cups. Yeah, they, they don't want to lose. This person doesn't want to lose. They're getting frustrated by the day. They, this person doesn't like to lose. They, they want to win at all costs. Uh, they're wondering uh, what to do. What's the two of uh, cups? What's the two of cups? Two of cups. They, somewhere they feel uh, the other person has already made a decision not to be with them. Somewhere they, they, maybe this person is juggling, I don't know. Maybe the other person is very confident, the Queen of Pentacles, who's also showing up as a Queen of Wands, very confident of themselves and said, you know what, I'm not interested in maybe just being a friend or friends with benefits or being part of a third party situation. They know they need to make a choice. They, need, they know they need to make a solid choice, come with a stable offer and before that, not even open their mouth till they have things in balance. This person is thinking, about how to make things right so that their offer is accepted justice what's the justice justice yeah maybe in the past this person lied they could have lied they could have uh, tried to get away with some you know um, illusions or something but now they know this guy need to come and speak their truth there is something that this person has been hiding or not talking about or um, trying to skim over the surface kind of a thing but now they know they need to make things right if they want this if they want something stable if they want something long term if they need to come and offer their full heart otherwise they will not be able to manifest this dream of theirs uh, they desperately want the ten of cups how many times is the ten of cups going to come out today spirit <laughs> okay tell me about the ten of cups what's the ten of cups Ten of Cups. This person wants to start a brand new journey. They want to show with effort. Uh, they want to show with effort uh, that I'm willing to work work on things. They want to end or 
any kind of conflict that there's been between the two of you and they want wanting the other person to put their barriers down they're a little afraid that the other person is maybe tired of them exhausted of them and as i said that i got the 10 of wands in reverse they are a bit worried that uh, the other person has already given up on them and dropped them uh, maybe will you know take off on a brand new journey elsewhere they may not get what they want but they are not going to stop without trying this person is very clear in their mind that they need to come forward with some truth or they are going to lose out on a soulmate connection and the very thought of that i think sets them into heartbreak they're holding on very tight to the hope that they can make things right uh four of wands in reverse four of wands in reverse yeah meanwhile i think this person is spying they are watching they are hoping that the other person hasn't totally gotten unstuck not moved on towards new love uh, because that's what they want to offer yes they're coming in as an emperor they're coming in as an emperor because they're coming in to claim their happiness you may not even see this person coming maybe they've been stagnant for a long time but when they do when they do come in it's going to be a shocker it's like this is lightning this person is when they come in they're going to come in correct or not at all so what's the high priestess in reverse spirit yes they're coming in to speak their truth and claim their person because they're really missing their person now uh high priestess in reverse spirit yep this is the truth that they want to tell i want you forever the 10 of pentacles this is commitment exactly what the angel said here's the card commitment anything else with the high priestess in reverse yep they want to end all kinds of arguments fights whatever you guys have had put you into their little boat and sail away somebody is really going to be taking action now they're coming in with full action mode i would say yeah maybe after a period of um, blockage uh, or maybe they have to end something from the past with the justice card and yes this person has to drop some something in their life uh, so that they have that courage or they are strong enough to then take that risk to take a leap of faith in the favor of the person who they really love so that's what i have for you till next time then aries love and light take care namaste